Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So let's talk lip care. So with the weather cooling down outside and indoor heating on, my lips have totally dried out. So I thought it would be fun to film a video in partnership with Burt's Bees on how to care for your lips this time of year and how to make sure that they're always soft and supple. Like these tips you can use all year round, but I thought it would be particularly helpful right now. Before we hop into this video, just a reminder to please hit that subscribe button and hit the little bell next to it so that you don't miss any of my content here on YouTube. So I'm really proud to partner with Burt's Bees because most of their products are 100% natural. It's fantastic. It's really important to me to put things on my body that are safe, that won't cause any problems for me down the line. And all of these products that I'm about to show you fit that bill. So, I really suffer from chapped lips in the fall and winter. It gets really, really bad. And this has been aggravated by mask wearing. So I've really, really upped my lip care. There are a few products that I really, really like by Burt's Bees. And one is the Burt's Bees Strawberry Lip Balm. So I really like this lip balm because not only is it softening and moisturizing, it smells really good. The strawberry is fabulous and it doesn't smell fake, but it just does such a great job at hydrating my lips. It has the perfect amount of shine, never feels waxy or gunky or anything like that. And love that it comes in the stick format because it's really easy to use. So Burt's Bees offers a range of different flavors, but I gotta say strawberry is my jam. So as you can see, it gives just a lovely amount of shine. It's perfect, it's not overly glossy, most certainly isn't sticky and it's lovely and just to stress again it's not waxy at all so you guys know i really like the natural look i like my skin to show through same with my lips i've really been embracing a more natural clean look and so that strawberry lip balm by burt's bees is just a really really nice hint of shine it's perfect so my glossy lip lovers out there will love the Burt's Bees Hydrating Lip Oil. This is a favorite of mine. It's super rich, hydrating and glossy. Again, doesn't feel gunky and gross and does a great job at making your lips smooth and wonderful. So again, this is made with responsibly sourced oils. I love that. It's environmentally sound and doesn't contain any ingredients that can be deemed harsh or harmful. So again, I really like this because it's super glossy if you want like an amped up, leveled up makeup look, but again, it's clear and beautiful and hydrating. So another way I like to use this lip oil is to layer it over a favorite lipstick, especially for the holiday season. I'm doing a lot of virtual parties online and still wanna look beautiful. So I'll get dolled up and I will layer this over my favorite red lipstick and it looks beautiful. But I have to say my favorite look is just on its own. That glossy, beautiful, simple shine is gorgeous. One of the first steps of my beauty routine is to exfoliate my lips. You can't have great looking lips, especially if you're wearing lipstick and your lips are all chapped. It'll just sort of ruin that lipstick look. And if you like the natural look, having beautifully soft lips that are free of any, you know, flaky skin is key. So three times a week, I'll use Burt's Bees Conditioning Lip Scrub. It gives you a great base because it exfoliates lips really, really well, getting rid of any dry, flaky skin that can ruin your lip look. It also clears away that flaky skin so that your Burt's Bees lip balm can penetrate better and do its job. So again, this is 100% natural origin and it works because it has honey crystals in it. And those honey crystals work to exfoliate the lips. Even with honey crystals in it, it feels very rich, hydrating, and creamy, and it most certainly isn't messy, and that's important to me. So I'll use about this much, and I'll just run it over my lips. So I usually do this three times a week before bed after brushing my teeth. So just rub it on, and I don't worry about getting it everywhere. I don't worry too much about making a mess. And I apply it in a circular motion, gently, okay? Don't go too hard, don't go to town on your lips. All you have to do is massage it in. I just use, again, a circular motion. 
and the base, sorry, <laughs> and the base of the scrub is really, really creamy. I leave it on for a few seconds. I'm just gonna close it up here. It's a good look. <laughs> and I wipe away the excess. So as you can see there, it wipes off really cleanly. It doesn't make a mess and it gets rid of any dry skin. It's really, really quick and easy and effective. All right, so the last step in my healthy lip care routine is using the Burt's Bees Overnight Intensive Lip Treatment. This is my favorite. So I use it every night before bed and I gotta admit, I use it throughout the day too, but it's really an overnight lip treatment. It has a really nice, fresh, minty smell, and a little goes a long way. Here's the consistency. And I use just a small amount and rub gently into lips. It has the nicest consistency. And you see, it has a really light shine that's lovely. And personally, I love that minty, fresh smell. What I love the most about this is when I wake up the following morning, it's like I have new lips. It works so, so well. Okay, so just to recap my healthy lip care routine, I start at night. I use my Burt's Bees Conditioning Lip Scrub and take a little finger full and massage it gently into my lips and then I wipe it away. And then I follow up with the Burt's Bees Overnight Intensive Lip Treatment. Again, it's creamy, hydrating, and the following day, it's like I have new lips. My chap lips have really subsided since I started using this nightly. And as I mentioned, I sometimes pop it into my handbag and use it throughout the day because it's just lovely. I'm on the go a lot. I work out a lot. I'm out walking my dog a lot. I exercise outdoors a lot and I protect my lips using the Burt's Bees Strawberry Lip Balm. This is my favorite, favorite, favorite flavor. It's tasty and never feels waxy or cakey or gunky. It's lovely. Oh, and it's not sticky. So if you run outdoors or you're out walking on a windy day, if you use this, your hair is not going to stick in it. And lastly, if I want to up my makeup look, or level it up just a bit, or if I'm rocking a natural makeup look but I want some gloss, I use my Burt's Bees Hydrating Lip Oil. It's got passion fruit oil in it, incredibly hydrating. The clear, glossy shine is just gorgeous, and it's not waxy, thick, or gunky whatsoever. So I will either layer it over lipstick or just use it on its own for that beautiful, healthy shine. Anyways, if you guys have any questions on any of these Burt's Bees products that I've featured, I would be happy to answer them for you. You can find them at your local drugstore or online, and they're clean beauty. Those of you who haven't dabbled in clean beauty yet, I highly suggest that you try it. Clean beauty brands have come a long, long way. There are a lot of colors for women who look like me, and they're just so, so effective. And putting your health first is really important. So I really hope you liked this video. Don't forget to give me the thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell next to the subscribe button so that you don't miss any of my content here. Feel free to DM me any questions that you have. I would love to hear from you guys. Anyways, I'm gonna sign off now. Love and appreciate you all. It means a ton to me that you watch. Take care.